In this video, I will show how to start SAP system. Just log on to Windows Server. Once you get the desktop, you just double click on SAP Management Console. Click OK here. Expand SAP Systems and uh, right click on dev that is SID of the SAP system click on the start click ok here and provide the password of administrator account you have to wait until everything is started that is this dev system should uh, display as green color in this if you expand here Actually, this is the main instance that is central instance. This is dialog instance. First central instance will be started. Expand. Click on AS above WP table. Before, before getting all the processes started here. First it will start the message server dispatcher and gateway. And then uh, AS above WP table will be started. Keep on refreshing here so that you will get the information in the right hand box. Your status should come to from run to wait and uh, start column should uh, turn from no to s. So everything is s here. You can uh, consider that system is completely started. Even status also should turn to wait. And it waiting means it is waiting for the request from the user. Just keep on refreshing. So it will be started. So once everything is started, even dialog instance also will be started from here as above WP table, here also everything will be started. Like this, yes. Okay, so in this way you can start SAP server. Once the SAP server is started, you can log on to the SAP systems using SAP logon program from any any computer within your network okay i will show you how to log on to the sap system in next my next video thanks for watching